have a t-shirt on. I'm still wearing my maternity shirts. Not for long. Here he is for his daily hug. <laughs> and multiple hugs a day. I'm like, and he will come and ask for it if he needs it this much. Clearly my kids do. And Thank you, girl. And if she sees me, yeah, there's a little smile. Oh, you have babies. Yes, I do. Okay, this is mine and that's Becky's. Like, look how much more creamy this one is. See the yellow goldish color and mine is just like, I got skim milk oh, and she's got cream. Great. You are watching The Boy Family Juice. Hello! Okay, you guys, I'm just finishing up at the gym and I'm afraid to go home because I fear it is going to be a disaster. <gasps> Cause Alex is home with the kids right now, but he works at the same time. So the, the house really suffers, but it's the sacrifice that I make to be able to work out for my brain <laughs> and my body. I'm telling you, it's for my brain first. So, another busy day ahead but maybe not quite as busy because since India is not doing gymnastics anymore she's not going to be going on Tuesdays and Thursdays and Fridays so that's kind of nice my Friday nights are finally open again because I had hated going to pick her up at 7 30 at night on a Friday on my date night so we'll see how today plays out I've got a very grouchy overtired toddler who denies everything Watch Nico do you want some lunch uh, uh, do you want some rice? Uh, uh, do you want a hug? Uh, do you want a kiss? Uh, uh, do you want to sing a song? Uh, uh, <laughs> do you want to go to Disneyland? Uh, uh, do you want a piece of candy? Uh, uh, do you want? <laughs> do you want me to give you a hug? Uh, uh, I want to go to Disneyland. I know you do. Nico, do you want to go take a nap? Uh, uh. Do you want to get a puppy? Uh, uh. Do you want to have some ice cream? Uh, uh. Do you love me? Uh, uh. Do you love Treyu? Uh, uh. <laughs> I'm telling you, he denies everything. <laughs> so we're going to give him some rice anyway and give him a hug anyway. Do you want me to give you a hug? Uh, uh. I'll give you a hug anyway. Do you want me to give you a kiss? Uh. I just got back from school and um, my friend gave me this cool little fidget thing. Uh, it helps with like anxiety and stuff. And I just do it through like math and everything. So it really helps. And yeah, how did he it just. Help? Like, how did it help you? I don't know. I just kind of played with it and it just got my mind off it, I guess. But yeah, I have some anxiety and I just kind of play with this and it really helps. So if you have anxiety, I don't know, just go on Amazon and like look up fidgets and then you'll get these cool little things. So yeah. Bye bye. I always try to give her a snuggie no! as she's leaving. No! Turn around. Let's no! show everybody a big fat snuggie. No! <laughs> okay, bye. bye. She's off to gymnastics and I Speaking of anxiety, what do you guys do about anxiety? Oils on your head, meditation, do you do massages? I do none of it <laughs> and I need something. I pick at my hair, I pick at my lips. I'm a picker for sure. And um, I mean, let's be honest, this year has just been anxiety ridden anyway because of what we've been dealing with. And, and it's well into 2021 also. <sighs> So I can't wait to be able to just let my hair down, you know, and I mean, not physically, but relax. And that brings me to my Mominator party. What should we do for Mominator 2021? We're also gonna be selling, celebrating my big 40, you guys. My birthday is September 5th and I'm turning the big four zero and it's gonna be a big party. So give me some ideas, what should we do? Okay, India's home and she's gonna demonstrate uh, fruit roll-up tattoos. The Star Wars. Wait, let me see it. Let me see it. 
It only works the first time. She had already done a tattoo. Go wash your mouth out. We'll try it again. I'd like to thank my sister for hooking me up with some liquid gold. Check this out. Bam! She found it. And I'm like, oh, yes. I mean, this can't be in one sitting. I used to be that productive. And now I get drips. Speaking of that, I got to go take my supplements. We got some multitasking. India's playing with Play-Doh while holding this for Naoma to look at. <laughs> a true woman. He's making a disaster. <laughs> Just chucked it. Tra Nico is killing me. He is in that stage of death. Oh my gosh, where he just gets into everything. And if you leave him alone for 30 seconds, it, you're, it, it's over. Look what has come in the mail. I mean, it's unbelievable that you can just get good quality because block is good. So is Capizio. Ballet shoes on Amazon. Please bless that they fit. Yeah, Got her a leotard as well as Capizio. Do they not fit? Well, you got to keep pulling. Yep. Woo, let me see. Those are perfect. Let me fix this. Yeah, you gotta you gotta turn the elastic around. Well, we can do, do it later. Now go up and releve. Do you know what releve is? Yes, those are so cute. I love them. Nice. Look at that. Perfect. Turn around. Let me see the back. Just a minute. Hang on. Look how cute the back is. I love it. With the classic undies. India, everybody. It is so nice out. I have a t-shirt on. I'm still wearing my maternity shirts. Not for long. And it feels so nice out here. I'm sure we'll get another storm. It's still North Pole over here. <laughs> I mean, look at my neighbors. No snow, hardly. I'm about to take Trey to preschool, but I just had to bask in the sun for a minute. The good news is that the weather is awesome at the moment. Bad news is this dude is coming home. If you're unfamiliar with our neighbor, Don, we have had some really bad run-ins with him. Um, he hates kids, I think. <laughs> He's very anal, doesn't want anybody to touch his grass, don't step on his lawn, don't step on his curb, don't step on his portion of the sidewalk. No, he doesn't own it, but he thinks he does. He's been in California for the last four months, which has been a beautiful thing. But apparently he's coming back. So we are on alert. You ready to go to school? Yeah. So is the dog. Here he is for his daily hug. <laughs> Has to have his daily hug and multiple hugs a day. I'm like, and he will come and ask for it if he needs it this much. Clearly my kids do and I am the worst at hugging. Can you believe that? He has to have his like arms around me. <laughs> Every day, he'll come and put his arms around me. Ah, oh, bud. Oh, God. <laughs> but he's such a good, obedient dog. He really is. Sometimes it takes me hearing from someone else something that my kids are good at, as well as my dog. And that mouth smells really bad. <laughs> but, like, someone told me that, you know, Ari is so giving. He's such a nice, giving, generous boy. And I was like, Yes, he is actually, but I like had to hear it from someone else. And somebody told me that the dog was super obedient. Like when we took him to, you know, be watched when we went out of town, they're like, he is so obedient. I'm like, oh my gosh, he is. Sometimes I have to hear it from somebody else and that makes me feel really bad. But he really is a good dog. Okay, this is one of my go-to snacks. Not just microwavable popcorn. The popcorn that I made myself. I just get the kernels and some coconut oil and I put it on medium heat with the lid on for like three minutes and it cooks and it's so good and it's like a daily snack it's only three tablespoons of kernels and a tablespoon of coconut oil and this is how much it gives me lots of fiber and a perfect snack here's this little sweetie if you haven't seen her for a minute 
She sees me. Yeah, there you little smile. Hi. Seven weeks old. Next week we'll have her two month appointment already, which I cannot even think about. I'm kind of shocked by this. So remember how I told you my sister gave me her milk? Let's look at the difference. I just recently pumped and she gave me her frozen. Okay. What? You have babies. Yes, I do. Okay, this is mine and that's Becky's. Like, look how much more creamy this one is. See the yellow goldish color and mine is just like, I got skim milk oh, and she's got cream. Maybe that's why my babies are skinny little runts huh? and that don't eat. Oh my gosh, like I feel less than. <laughs> this is the most uncomfortable thing to shop for, I tell you. Especially when people are around. I'm like pretending that I'm looking at aspirin and lidocaine patches. Oh my gosh. Don't tell. Oh my Don't gosh, tell. I gotta grab something to like disguise it. There. Only me? <laughs> always, always self checkout. Always. <laughs> 